No, but not true. You know that I never wear the wig now. I wash all my wig. I never wear them today. This my friend Shashi. She's a big girl. You see, she said. You know that it just matters because I never wash your wig with all these cheap cheap shampoo. Now they make them rough like this. No, this your fiber. Yeah, this is the fiber. Now they make them rough like this. No, this your fiber. Yeah, this is the fiber. Now they make them rough like this. No, this your fiber. Yeah, this is the fiber. Now they make them rough like this. No, this your fiber. Yeah, this is the fiber. Now they make them Okay, you stress me. Ah, you're fine. Okay, you stress me. I'm not stressing me. They put the column. Don't say I really wish the column. They quarry lamb, so they generate the quarries for last. So since that time, they bleached it. No, it's been bleached before. I I did that. So what do you mean to do now? It was not the same column. Eh, I want to bleach it. Eh, if you bleach, I'm rich like that. Hmm. I don't want to reduce the length of the Yes, now. I should not reduce it. What if you keep on with the edge with the. Yeah, reduce some, reduce some. Like uh, like the way they take swam. Yeah. The way they take swam, I'm sure I can buy the thing. So, well, so, got my piercing done. And then we came to drop our wigs for fixing. <laughs> Okay, this one is so small. I take your option. Now I'm not the problem. Man, that's okay, the one I would say, yeah. You've been right. terrorizing me, and yeah, I'm always wrong. I knew you lost your mind when you dropped that bomb. Girl, are you crazy? Yeah, you must be crazy. <laughs> That's it. Yes, that's it. Oh yeah. How much? Twenty eight thousand five hundred. Finally, finally. Did you actually know? Nope. Whiskey. Thank you for that one. The oil has. Thank you for the oil. Mm. From Chef. Hey. Chef S. Chef Freeze. Huh? And who said I like trains? It gets me where I need to go. It's even now that you're saying it's even making sense. You know, recognize the man with the mash.
this your we're comb using is very the, fine and this comb not for anybody the way we the way cotton combs get missing in this house i don't understand you know how people's houses some of them one leg of socks we get missing in my house we find socks like socks are most times maybe once in a year we'll look for one leg of socks but you see cotton comb we don't understand how it disappears anyway so i am wearing my i love this product is a bolding brightening moisturizer it has spf 30 and it also has vitamin c so that is usually what i will just wear on my face when i'm done having my bath i'll spray my face with rose water first um because when i get out of the bathroom my face is usually very dry so while i'm wearing my clothes the rose water will be drying on my face and then i'll just wear this moisturizer which i love so much this is the balance I mean, C brightening serum. So we're gonna drop that. Even though the dropper belongs to me, I don't let it touch my face. I don't know why people do that. Okay, it doesn't have to touch your face. So I want to loosen my hair because my cornrows are not looking good. I also switched out my earring to this very cute one from Ana Luisa. I love that brand. This earring is a hoggy that I got from them and. It fits so nicely like it just hugs my um lobe and it's cute i like it sister did victoria you, did you say thank you to who that person that got this i worked with them as i said did you say thank you i worked with them last year all right, all right. <laughs> Mosquito me. bited me. That's why it was, <coughs> why it was <coughs> scratching me. Mosquito bited you. Can you correct yourself? Mosquito bites me. <coughs> hey! Chima <coughs> temo! Mosquito bites me. Hey! 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 Hey, what? Mosquito bite. Eh? Bite. God, I beg you. In this era of expensive school fees, as a mosquito beats me, as I say it again and again Mommy. and again, as I say mosquito beats me. Mosquito beats me. Mosquito what? Beat me. Mosquito what? Beat me. <sighs> if you had come into my house yesterday, you would have just walked in like a king. Maybe you just struggle a bit with pushing this chair, but you're walking like a king. So, we are changing the handle of the door. As well as going with the carpenter or the person that is fixing it to buy another one. The girl's bed fell. <laughs> oh my god. I don't even know where to start from at this point because I have been... I've had issues with this bed from the onset, right? Like my husband was saying yesterday that thank God it didn't fall when Victoria was sleeping because if I tell you that I've never thought of this thing falling when Victoria is under, know that I'm lying. I have... I don't even know where to start this story from because if I start talking, it's going to be too long. When I wanted to make this bed, I was torn between using the carpenter that I had talked to about it and buying from a furniture person on instagram um the lady that makes furniture had priced it and then i'd also asked the carpenter and the one i wanted to buy was almost like the price i would have paid um for the instagram seller or to the instagram seller is about three times of what i paid for this one almost three times of what i paid for this one but when this thing happened i just said you know what i now understand why Sometimes just do quality and don't even think of saving costs because I know that her things are really good quality. They do them well. You won't have problems from what I've seen. And I've known her for quite a while. I actually did an ad. She was one of the very first brands that I did 
an integrated ad on a YouTube video for her when I just around the time I just started vlogging in this house when we moved in. So I've known I followed the brand for a couple of years. The carpenter that made this one, he made it. He didn't even collect his balance because he knew how upset I was about the way he made the bed, the way the bed looked, the finishing of the bed. So he didn't even collect. I think I had had like twenty or thirty thousand naira left, and he didn't even waste to collect it because I was so mad when he brought the bed. Since that time, we've had so many issues with the drawer. I've gotten someone to fix it. Um, just issues here and there. Even this thing that fell, I've had somebody another carpenter come to like hold it together. But now this one is a new one. It fell. I don't even know how it fell because I was just too pissed to even ask my nanny. I just came back and said, "Oh, the children's bed has fallen." So Vicky and Ella slept on the lower bed. So what I'm thinking of doing is the carpenter, the person fixing the door would come and fix it. But I might have to swap the girls. I'm thinking of swapping them. So I think I would want Victoria to sleep up and then Ella to come down. Does your older child sleep on the top bunk or on the lower bunk? Because I just felt since Ella is older, you know, she would be able to manage the responsibilities that come with sleeping up because she would have to climb up and all of that. But now, considering a couple of other things, I'm not thinking, you know what, maybe because Victoria is smaller, she should sleep up. Plus, the fact that our ceiling is not very high, so that's the reason why we also lifted their fan up. So we had to cut the rod of the fan and then we lifted it all the way up it's going to take some convincing i know um hopefully it's it goes smoother than i actually think it will go because this children would i know that ella would try to fight it and say no me i want to remain on my upper bunk but let's see how it goes you never know with children they can be unpredictable let's see how it goes and that's why i did not uh, try to cut costs when I was doing their drawers and then my work table because I had already experienced this one. So I was like, you know what? I don't mind paying more for it as long as it gets done and it's done properly. And I've not had any problem with my table and their drawers. So, you know, I was very particular about that. But I'd already made a mistake with the bed. It's tiring. So yeah, I'm just waiting for the carpenter. So yeah, let's see how it goes. I want to go and make lunch. Um, I want to make spaghetti. I don't, I'm not even sure what I want to make because... I've not been able to withdraw money. There's no money. The ATMs are not working. POS people don't have cash. So I don't even have money to buy anything. I have just 2,000 naira new um, old notes. And I've not been able to spend them. I want to cook now. And in the real sense of it, I need green peppers. I need chicken. I need... Um, I need a couple of veggies yeah, to make stir fry spaghetti because Ella had been asking me for spaghetti during the school week and she ended up making spaghetti. So I want to make spaghetti with minced meat. Um, and I'm not able to because I don't even have money to buy these things. These are things I cannot buy with my card. I have to pay in cash. Um, I don't know what next week is going to look like. I, I'm not sure. I don't know. But yeah, let me get right into what I have to do. It is about 11 p.m. A few minutes past 11. Um, so the person fixing the girl's bed fixed it, but you know how someone will fix the bed and then they'll be like, oh, check it and see if everything's okay. I checked, it looked okay, but when he left, I found out that there were a couple of things he didn't do well. So he will come back on maybe tomorrow, Sunday or Monday to come and fix a few other things. He did the job well. So I wanted him to come and look at Grace's bed because we've had like small issues with Grace's bed that another incompetent carpenter fixed. So I would like him to correct them. But yeah, the girls are back on their bed. I just brought chicken out of the oven um, to prepare for tomorrow so that I don't have so much work to do tomorrow. I decided to just cook the chicken now. So that tomorrow I'll just make stew or fried rice or whatever it is we're going to have tomorrow. I just want to pack this, put it in the freezer. Have my bath and go to bed.